So that's eight movements. I'm now um, watching the half moon. So the wide position of the legs. And looking up, wrapping the stick around and looking up at the moon. Breathing out as you come down. In, wrapping the stick around, looking up at the moon. and then coming back to resting. This is the bird slanting flying. So you raise the stick in breath and then looking at the right hand end of the stick And this is ringing out the intestine, so really ring. In breath, out breath. In breath. Watching the end of the stick. back to resting. So the wide step, this is looking back at the heel. So breathing in as you go up, turning the left foot, turning the right foot, and then looking back at the heel. So breathing in, turning left, turning the right, turning left, looking back at the heel. Breathing in. I remember my teacher saying to me, can you see your heel? I said, oh, of course I can see my heel. It took a long time before I realized I wasn't really seeing my heel. Then coming back to resting. Enjoying the breath coming in. Enjoying resting. Now this is the tortoise plays with the magic sword, or the magic sword tortoise plays. Um, you try and keep the hand at this, the level of the neck and either your other hand in here or behind your back. And you watch the sword going round because you want to keep your head out of the way. So breathing in. So your head ducks back out of the way of the sword. And watching the sword all the way around. change the direction. So clockwise, now we go anti-clockwise. Okay, put the sword down, take it with the other hand. 
clockwise. Three, then the other way. Okay. Resting. Checking how you feel. This is a meditation on the body, in the body. Bringing the mind back to the body. Okay, so enjoying our breathing. And we've come to the last four exercises. So, actually with this one, we stay with our feet together. And then breathing in, stretching up, holding the stick lightly. Breathing in as you go up, breathing out as you go down. And just feeling the stretch in the body, really opening the chest and stretching the arms gently, not forcing, but really feeling the opening and then coming to resting. Enjoying breath in and enjoying breath out. And relaxing the body with the breath. Enjoying the in-breath and relaxing with the out-breath. This exercise is called Farmer Working the Paddy Field. So feet a little bit apart and we come up on our heels so the heels are not touching the ground for the whole exercise. So breathing in, going up, and then breathing out, keeping the back straight and coming down as low as you can. So over time, we come down lower. And if you choose a point ahead of you, and may help with your stability if you focus on that point. And maybe just enjoying giving way to gravity going down. And then resting back on the heels. And then resting. Now the next one is the penultimate one. So legs fairly far apart and breathing out as you go down. Breathing in as you turn to the left. Breathing out as you go down. And you can do it fast if you're young. You can do it fast if you're old, but find uh, the speed that you enjoy. Coming back to the center and then reversing. Breathing in, breathing out, and coming back to resting. So I've been doing three each side, but when you do it, I would recommend five each side, or 10 or 20. So enjoying the breathing. Enjoying the feeling in the body. So this is the last exercise. 
this is rowing to the other shore. So the stick, left foot forward, and the stick is at a right angle, hand on the end, and then you breathe in as you go forward, out as you come back. So just rowing gently so that you could row all day. Then reversing the, the direction, breathing in. Then moving your oar to the other side, stepping back, stepping forward with the right foot. Breathing in as you go forward, breathing out as you come back. And then reversing the position, or reversing the direction. Breathing in, out. Breathing in, breathing out. Breathing in, breathing out. Then coming back to resting. And that's the end of the 16. So we just regularize the breath, breathing in, really stretching, opening in the ribs, breathing out. Breathing in. Breathing in. Breathing out. So bowing, if you're doing it with other people, to the other people you're doing it with, and then bowing to the cosmos, bowing to Gaia. And of course, bowing to the ancestral teachers and your own teachers who've taught you. Thank you.